Well, what's happening outside today? Oh, uh, well, it's cold. It's also really dry, too. I've noticed I've needed to uh, use more lotion out there. You'll notice your hands are uh, dry, skin is dry as you head outside. Uh, we're seeing those chilly east winds, but take a look up towards Mount Hood. It's gorgeous out there at the moment. Blue skies and some nice conditions for some skiing. We'll get some new snow as we head towards the end of the weekend up in the mountains. Uh, but now we're still dealing with those cold easterly winds, 31 mile per hour uh, sustained winds now pushing through the metro area and at the airport. It is breezy outside, even though temperatures are in the low to mid 40s now for the region. Lots of sun out there too, but those winds again have just been cutting through the air. Out at the coast, we're getting some high winds out there too, and those uh, waves are now crashing along the shores too. So a small craft advisory out there through today as well. Uh, but again, lots of sunshine. It's a nice day, just breezy out there. Here's a look at the current wind speeds. Sustained winds at about 20 out of Troutdale. And again, they'll continue as we head towards the afternoon and also into much of our day tomorrow. Peak winds from yesterday though, 31 uh, uh, miles per hour sustained. We've already matched that for today. And look at those peak uh, wind gusts too, around 40 in Portland, a uh, trout tail nearing a 40 as well. Almost hurricane force winds at Vista House up there in the gorge, a 71 mile per hour gust. That was uh, very windy out there. We had Elise Haas out there reporting early in the morning and winds continue to gust around 50 to 60 up at Vista House uh, still uh, this afternoon. Here's a look at our weather pattern. Still dry, the ridge of high pressure. You can see that big dome again over the northwest that's keeping us dry for now, but changes come as we head towards the weekend. A small disturbance there. Uh, Friday night into Saturday will likely start the valley Saturday morning with some showers and some possible freezing rain in parts of the gorge as we head towards Saturday morning and also into Sunday as that larger system again moves through. So rain comes as we head towards the weekend, but we're still looking sunny uh, for today. Beautiful afternoon again at the coast. 47 degrees there for areas in the upper 40s, mainly for the beaches. Uh, we will see 45 degrees in Portland today or the mid 40s for a lot of the valley. Overnight lows back to near freezing or a little bit below. It's going to be a cold night again with those winds continuing to gust at least into tomorrow morning. So still those bitter cold winds continue. Some fog and low clouds still out in central Oregon. Highs today only near freezing there and bend and same for out near Pendleton in the gorge. Uh, we will see temperatures ending near freezing too. Still that low cloud cover out there with that inversion in place. So here's our rain and cloud forecast again. A few showers as we head towards the weekend but look at all those pinks. That is some mixed precipitation, possibly freezing rain for the eastern foothills of uh, Mount Hood and through Hood River. Again, we will see those conditions, uh, icy conditions possible as we head into Saturday morning, mainly out for the gourds. We'll be watching that as we head into tomorrow. Here's our seven day forecast, though, dry for the next couple of days. But by the weekend, we see some rainfall returning back in the forecast. And the sun goes away just in time for the uh, weekend. Just in time for the weekend, I know. Yeah. Perfect timing with we that. We need the rain, though. It looks a little we warmer do. anyway. Much the... of the state or the entire state is actually in a drought, so yeah. we would love that rain to come. Okay. Thanks, right. Kelly. We'll be right back. Stick around.